Hey guys, are you getting the camera failed error on your Samsung phone after rooting it? Don't worry. In this quick video, I'll show you a simple and beginner friendly way to fix the camera failed problem in just a few minutes. And yes, this is a proven method, but it only works if your phone is rooted. We'll fix it using Magisk and a terminal app. No advanced skills needed. Just follow along step by step and let's get started. So I just rooted my Samsung Galaxy A52s and right after that, when I opened the camera app, it showed the camera failed error. Even after clearing the camera app's data, the problem didn't go away. So to fix this, you'll need to download two files from the description box, a Magisk module and a terminal app. First, go ahead and install the Termux app. This will allow us to run commands as root on the device. Once Termux is installed, open the Magisk app. Now go to the module section and tap on install from storage. Here, select the Magisk Hide Props module file that you downloaded. Once you select it, go ahead and install it. It might take a few seconds, so just wait for the installation to finish. Once installation is done, go ahead and reboot your device. Basically, this module allows us to safely change certain system properties without needing to manually edit any files. So let's wait until the device fully boots up. All right, the device has now booted up. Let's move on. First, go ahead and open the Termux app. Now in Termux, the first thing you need to type is SU, then hit enter. This will ask for root access. Just tap grant the permission when the pop-up appears. Once that's done, we are now running as root in Termux. Next T, put type ka, props in terminal and hit enter. This will open the Magisk Hide Props menu inside Termux. Once the menu appears, you'll see a list of options. Here, type 2 and press enter. This option lets us edit the device fingerprint. Now, type C and enter. That's the shortcut for custom value. Next, it asks for the value type SM-A526B. That's the device model we're spoofing. It's compatible and helps fix the camera issue. Now, it'll ask if you want to confirm. Type Y and enter. Now it is asking to reboot the device to apply changes. Just type Y and enter. Your phone will reboot automatically after that. So just wait for it to restart. Let me quickly fast forward while it boots up. All right, the device is back on now. Let's go ahead and open the camera app and yep, let's hope for the best. And there it is. No more camera failed error the camera is working just like it should. Basically, what we do is trick the system into thinking our phone is a different model. The system thinks it's running on a compatible device and the camera starts working again. So by this way, you can fix the camera failed issue on any rooted Samsung device safely and easily. If this video helped you out, make sure to give it a like and subscribe for more Android fixes, custom ROM guides and routing tutorials. And if you have any questions or if something didn't work, just drop a comment below. I'll do my best to help you out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.